It's possible to hit a watermelon with a needle eye shell from three kilometers away, although the stunt was not rec replicatable. It doesn't sound... It, it sounds like it's really far away. I don't, I don't actually know if that's the case, though. Uh, I really wish I could search for, like, ventral or something. Because we could also have, like, the heavy auto cannons. But no, we need something that aims further down. Deck cannons, coastal defense, flipped ventral, bolt light cannon. Close. It doesn't shoot down that well. Pretty accurate, though. Decent damage. Kind of expensive, though. Okay, this looks closer to what I'm going for. Large corner mounted cannon. That seems about right. Chip is too heavy to fly, no propulsion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So we want to do lift. We probably want a, a large suspendium chamber. Oh, they have to be on top. Um, hmm. Okay. That kind of works. We could use another ladder. Corridor with ladder. Okay, we got that. No crew, more supply hatches, no propulsion. Well, so there is the, um... Was it under weapon? No, it wasn't under weapons. It was under WF modules. Boop, boop, we don't want one of those. I mean, I, I could. Suspendium drive. Tons of lift, tons of propulsion. It's, I, it's very expensive. Uh, service ceiling is... <laughs> That's a little bit much. I do not need something that that substantial at all. Oof. Uh, I'll get that when I make the super heavy bomber. Fla flame bomber? We'll, we'll make uh, something that's entirely dedicated to, like, extreme bombs. But that'll be... Um... <laughs> that'll be something else that we we work on. Okay, so what what was the large suspending chamber again? One coal every 10 seconds. Yeah, it's worth it. Oh, commerce, trade stores. It generates a little bit of money. It's not much. We'll have to keep looking for upgrades. Okay, so we're going to need a steel supply hatch. We're going to need quarters and a repair bay. We've got fire. We have no propulsion. And we don't have anything else. And that's a fly on my desk. And that's a dead fly. Gross. Okay, uh, let's see. Cannot give commands to ship. Well, we should probably get a bridge up in here. I mean, I could put it at the very bottom. And then all we need is propulsion. This is a very small ship, comparatively, but honestly, I kind of like small ships. Okay, uh, so we need we need propulsion. I haven't looked into it that much. Propulsion. We've got problems. Have I not researched any kind of propulsion yet? Uh, 
It's very slow. What about one of these? What about one of these? Okay. That doesn't work. Double sail. No, large sail looked like it worked the best. Okay. And then we're going to need some basic crew. Move this one back. Maybe? Can we have just a little bit more... Where's the... There's the quarters. Can I fit them here? Nope. Quarters. Can I... Okay, good. I can fit them there. We do need a little bit more supply, though. And some more crew. Okay. So next up, steel supply hatches. Bridge. Okay. And this is going to be called the... Um, God, I don't even know. S service ceiling is pretty damn low. I might want to rethink some of these things. I should probably also check the armor. Uh, is it using stone walls? It's using stone walls. Which, okay. Right. Steel armor is really, really heavy. So it was, it was using steel walls. Okay, well that, that's about as good as I'm going to be able to get it. This sucker is heavy. It's probably, it's probably these things. Yeah, 115 on these. Okay, let's let's rethink those guns. They're really cool. I think I need something better than that. I actually did not increase the surface ceiling that much. Never mind. I guess we're just going to go with this and uh maybe just get a couple of muskets off the off the front. It's not what I want. But I don't think I have much of a choice, at least for now. So what are we going to name this thing? The, uh... Dingy? Sure. Almost looks like Dingy. Well, we're going to save it as this, and we'll see how it goes. I mean, I'll be making enough money that I shouldn't have to worry about much. Especially once we get those better trade modules. Could add another suspendium drive behind the first one. Yeah, that's... One of my next, um... Goals. Helicarrier blades. Ooh. Okay. Well, let's look into getting s expert repairs in science labs and stuff. Because, yeah, if I can make science labs... Maybe we can, uh, speed up this research even more. Maybe... I'm not actually sure if it's really that helpful. I just like the idea of uh, state-funded mad science. That just sounds cool. All right, so that's done. Yeah, we wanna... I love this research tree now. This is much closer to what I wanted to do. Specialized resource industries. Suspendium cannon spiders. None of these really look like the research, uh, the, the funding that I was looking for. Deployable independent motorcycle, mechanical motorcycles. Huh. Alright. Basic tents? Simple housing floor stacking. What the hell? These are considerable. Necessity armor, stacked armor. Crack it? Uh, Call of Krakulu. Moons above, what have you done? Oh, hi. Okay, well, we've already got that. Um, 
We could just research spiders. <laughs> let's just ugh. let's just research spiders. And let's let's save. As Mo Guns Mo Boom One. And we're already done with that science. Alright. Um Well, we've reached our science. So let's let's learn about suspendium bees. Now let's let's slow the game speed down. And I'm gonna go attack the steel mechanical spider. Let's see how this goes. Oh, that thing actually has a pretty damn high service ceiling. This will back up a little bit. Okay, so this thing's a lot better than I thought it was it was going to be. I'm not entirely sure if it's as good as I want it to be, but that's okay. Anyway. No, yeah, those things can actually shoot pretty much directly down, which is kind of nice. Anyway, we're just gonna get to the opposite side, flip, and then back up some more and just more or less, uh... More or less just kite the thing back and forth across the, uh... Across the entire arena. Okay, maybe not that much. I should probably look into what some of these other commands do at some point. Have we even really hurt the thing? It looks like I'm putting some dings in it, and it's certainly, like, not moving well. But I think I'm just gonna flee. And we're just gonna go hang out at Pagora. I could fight the thing, but it didn't... Oh. He's attacking me at Toothford. I don't think I'm going to win this one. Okay, so let's let's go let's go take Toothford back. Oh right, I'm not constrained to road roads. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna need to build some better setups. Buzzer sub sub ships. There's so much. Get propellers. I want to look into non suspendium based flight. Helicarrier bl helicarrier blades sound really really fun to me. Uh, is he going to move out of his effective range to just float directly be beneath me? Which is his ship? But yeah, it looks like these things are actually considerably better uh, than I thought they would be. Unfortunately, I'm probably going to have to destroy my own industrial facility facilities, which means I need to uh, cover them in guns. Well, at this point, they are not putting up any kind of fight. Okay. And go for that tower. Yeah, I gotta add some more defenses. Because, yeah. Them taking these kind of sucks. I guess the one thing I could do... Instead of building these as permanent buildings, I think I might just make some really... Uh, 
Let's just flee. I might just make a quote-unquote mobile uh, grinder. Yeah, I think I'll work on that. Okay, let's do non-suspendium based flight. Okay, let's go take Toothford back. Oh, there's some raiders nearby I can go raid. Okay, well, let's speed this up. Hopefully we don't destroy the, uh, the expensive bit, but I get the feeling we will. Yeah, in retrospect, I should have armored this thing with wood, maybe. Nope, there goes the expensive bits. Well, they were disarmed. Go back to Toothford. Build Tower of Mad Science and Fun. What? That's really expensive. <laughs> I don't think I can. All right, let's get the let's get the helicarrier blades. They they that sounds fun. Okay, Toothford's defenses. Oh, are fine. Fragment of Grand Garrison. Well, that's right out. Do we ever learn how to make rifles? What about heavy machine guns? Heavy machine guns have a decent range. What about the lightning gun? Nope. Long rifle. Pretty damn good. Because otherwise we could do stuff like the heavy gatling flak guns. What's the angle at which these things can fire? Pretty good, but we'd have to be, they'd have to be above me. Then again, they generally do just immediately go directly above me. Pretty accurate. Okay. Uh, let's do the heavy Gatling flat cannon. We're just gonna have two. So, barracks, ammo store, Repair bay. Fire point. And we need supply hatches. Got plenty of supplies, so yeah, all we need is just a, a corridor here. Alright, then let's move this thing. Honestly, I'm actually going to move it in front. And just in case we do get attacked from the other directions. How expensive is this thing? Building cannot be placed here. Modules are not accessible. Oh, freaking... Who, who cares? There we go. Cannot give commands to building, but that's okay. Uh, ammo box. No, I've already got a ammo on this. A uh, hundred ammo should be enough for this thing. All right, the uh, yeah, sure. Let's let's call this the fragment of Grand Garrison. That's kind of a neat name. Uh, what kind of armor do we have on this thing? It looks like we've got. Cause what's what's steel versus stone? It's like the same thing. All right, whatever. That, that should keep my foes off of me, at least for a little while. Uh, while we're here, let's let's learn rifles, because we probably should start learning that. Okay, Empire Details, it's time to crank up the secret police. Defenses. Okay, what did I build? Oh, this is the this is the one with the defensive structures. 
So let's, let's see what this thing, how this thing does against uh, my defenses at Pagora. It's, uh... It's looking good for me. It's not looking great for him. It's looking real good for me! <laughs> Whoa! That thing went down in a second. I seriously don't understand the loyalty that has been inspired in the soldiers in this game. Okay. Uh, let's go to Kastavik. Defenses. Build building. The, we gotta... We're gonna build another squat. And Toothford. Defenses. So we're building another one of those, but honestly, I'm gonna build another squat. Squats are cheap, and uh, freaking effective. Okay, we don't have enough. We don't have enough money to make another squat. Okay, so we're done with that. Let's let's actually go for bombs, rockets, so we can get the extra ammo storage. This is, uh, working out better than I was expecting. Yeah, the doubled cannon accuracy uh, made a massive difference. Let's see, extra ammo storage or reduced ammo storage flammability. You know, let's do the reduced ammo storage flammability. Fire sucks. Uh, let's see. We should probably start conquering. Maybe. Maybe. So we've already got that. Turrets, biplane bombers, aerial torpedoes. Let's see. I guess we might as well research unlife over here. I don't know if that's going to be that helpful. Okay, can I design a ship? I just want to take a look at commercial. Commerce. Okay, dust collector versus trade stores. Pricey. Advanced suspendium dust scrubber that extracts suspendium particles. Okay, so that's 0.5. So if I just put this down... Oh. No, that's a little bit more. It makes the maintenance negative 100. What about this thing? Negative 10. So we want to save up for dust collectors. What I might do is just make a blimp uh, at some point that is just those. Oh, we want to get faster cannon reload times. So we should probably start going down that, that direction. Ground-based troops. Some of these are interesting. I, I can't wait to try them out. Anyway, we can go for the Hussars. We can go with... Nope. We got to get the Harpooners as well. Okay, while we're here, let's... Let's design... A... Land ship? No, we're, we're just going to design a ship. Can I give it the excavators? Actually, no. These things are heavy as shit. And very expensive. Design land ship. So the excavators are just as... as... functional, financially. Okay, so we need... We need so very little. This thing is not meant to move. How is boarding? Uh, it works. It actually works rather well. Uh, I just don't bother with it because I've got other things in mind. Bad ideas in mind, mainly. Okay, so we don't really need a bridge, but I don't think I have much of a... Yeah, we have an exposed cockpit. 
Oh well. Uh, we'll just get a we'll get a bridge. We'll get a coal store. We'll get quarters. We need more quarters. Apparently, this thing requires some um, supply hatches. Okay, basic propulsion. Yeah, sure. Working as intended. We're just going to call it the shh. I'll fix it later. So we want to save up for that thing. And I'm just going to have that thing very slowly. Wait. I wonder if I could actually put that on two legs instead of just one. That's an interesting question. The other thing I should consider, actually, is just getting expanding. It. I just really like the idea of a very uh, tall empire this time around, instead of anything that I have to defend. Because yeah, if I just load mo mo gun guns more mo uh, mo boom with just stuff, it might actually work. How much is it to build another uh, dinghy? Dinghies are 1600. Okay. Well, let's wait for that one. Are you going for Kastovic? Why are you going for Kastovic? You should know what happens when you go for Kastovic. <laughs> I might want to get another one of those. Let's see, heavy steel armor. There we go. I should probably look into getting the massive stone walls. Uh, you know what? Let's let's go for that. That way I can heavily armor my um my own defenses. Okay, we already got the heavy reload. Okay, let's 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 build a uh let's build another dinghy. Nope. Next month. There we go. I'm going to build another dinghy just so I can start conquering. Because that seems like a reasonable idea. Okay, now we get the heavy steel armor. I think my dinghies will be, will be adequate for what I'm doing here. I really wish you could queue up multiple bits of science at the ta same time. Uh, flesh crackers. Oh, we want to go for this. Spider legs? Legs. Oh, right. Yeah, I should I should probably go for that ASAP anyway. A buzzer subships or modular buzzer parts. Those sound interesting, but I gotta figure out what they actually do first. Anyway. Uh we could also look into fire extinguishers. Let's go grab that first. That might be a passive. Okay, legs. Because, yeah, it's a probably good idea to start going after my neighbors. Werewolves! Sure. We'll get there at some point. How are these guys doing? Looks like we've got one neighbor that is currently conquering the rest by, like, not a small degree. Spendium cannons. What do I need for this? Flat cannons. Okay. Move him there. Okay. And can we get... Nope, that's basic tents. Sailor maintenance cost. That's something I'll have to look into. No, I wanted this one. Why can I not get 
Why can I not get this yet? Oh, we still haven't gotten spider legs yet. Ugh. He's going for Pagora, eh? Instead, I am going for him! Alright, uh, let's do... There. Reduced steel armor weight. There we go. <sighs> let's move him back. He'll have to come at me. And, uh, this is what we call a height advantage. Oh, he does have some... He does have a, a fort with defenses back there. Okay, well that's... I'm gonna operate under the assumption that that is, uh... That's a done deal. We'll come back for him in a bit. We're gonna want to look into some heavier steel armor at some point. But honestly, my plan is... I'm not gonna... I, I will probably get some of the ridiculous, uh... I, I will probably get some of the really ridiculous, like... Tank guns on an actual tank. But I kind of want to focus on airships this time around. Uh, and make, like, the really big ones. I Ideally, I'd really like to have, like... Effectively, this giant floating fortress. Flies higher than anybody else and is just covered in cannons. Because, yeah, the, the cannon accuracy upgrade that I went with is making a... Just massive, massive difference. Brutal takeover. What do we have in, uh, Sp Speltford? Oh, he's coming after more guns, more boom. It's fine. Yeah, they're not exactly the, uh... They're not the best. We should go kill those raiders. But it's fine. Uh, let's, let's go take, uh, Coburg.